Red Dead Redemption 2 Gameplay Part 13 Okay Game Arm Chiro Adhukum Nadi Kapadi 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 Sakti men, but I won't give Arthur, have you seen that boy, Jack? No. Jack Where's my Kahnama? goddamn son? Where is he? Where's my son? They took him, didn't they? They took my son. Who took him? We think the Braithwaite woman took him. Oh. When Kieran saw a couple of fellows sound like Braithwaite boys. Where's my son? If anything, I... where is my son, Dutch Vandalin? We will find him. We will bring him back to you, and we will kill any fool that had the temerity to touch one hair on that boy's head. Abigail, you have my word. Just get me back, my son. I will get that boy back, so help me God. Right now. Dutch. We just heard about that. We need some extra guns. Yeah, why not? Micah, Kieran, anyone strange turns up, you kill him. Rest of you, let's ride. Okay. Let's go get that boy back. They must have figured out what we was up to, Dutch. Yeah, we just got shot to hell by the Greys in town. I know. I Jack heard about John too. I don't want to think about that right now. We have to focus on Jack. I swear! I'll kill everyone there! Easy, John. Try to stay calm. I'm fine. How the hell did they get to him? I don't know. We are getting him back and they will pay. I promise you that. What about the gold? Who gives a damn about the gold? They got Jack! I hate to break it to you, but I don't think there is any gold. And if there is, it's hidden somewhere no one knows. What? I've turned every stone. For Christ's sake, Hosea. After all that, another perfect scam. We underestimated them. No, they underestimated us. Enough talk. There is no point arguing how we got here. This <laughs> is where <laughs> we are. And we are going to fix it. So come on. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Okay, get your heads right. Nobody makes a move until I say so. I see. Come to me. 
We'll go in on foot from here. First Sean, now Jack. We should have stayed out of all of this. Bit late for that, ain't it? Quiet. We're going to fix this right now. Come on, let's get this done. John, you sure you're okay? Like I said, I'm fine. Follow my lead. Both these redneck families think they can ruin us? I don't think so. There they are. Who steals a goddamn boy? I'm gonna let fly at those sons of bitches! John, I need you to stay calm. Get down here now! You inbred trash! What the hell do you want? Easy, John. We've come for the boy. You must have known we would. Shouldn't have messed with our business now, should you? Whatever complaint you have with us, alleged or otherwise, oh, you want to have business that is a young boy. boy. That is not the way you do things. Hand him over. Get the hell off our land. If you ain't gonna be civilized about this, Looks 
in this house for 120 years. We never had no problem except fighting Where Yankees. is the boy? Who took him? You killed my son. Oh, and I will surely kill the rest of them unless you start talking. Oh, I know your time. Common scum. Where is the boy? You filth. All right, we get her out uh, of here. Uh, what about them? Take the boy, Mrs. Braithwaite. You stole Boys my Boys are liquor. off limits. You stole my horses. Ain't hey, no rules in war, Mr. Matthews. Yes, yes, that's it. Where's the boy? My sons gave him to Angelo Bronte. So my guess is Saint Denis. Either there or on my boat to Italy. Let's go. Arthur, come on. What are we doing with her? Leave her. I told you she was crazy. Watch out, watch out. Hey, yeah, we'll look for her. We take a little thing, sir. One of some of the gang. Your mom made a gangster and charm for the lad. It's gonna work out, John. It's gonna work out. Listen to Dutch. Now, I don't expect you to understand this, but I have never been more proud of you than I am right now, brother. You're doing the right thing. If I don't get that boy back safe, I'm... She, she'll kill us all. I know, but looking at this logically, well, that boy is fine. They took him to scare us. Nobody takes a boy to harm him. He's right, John. What do you think, Arthur? My boy will be fine. But, well, of course Marston scared Rotten. We, we killed all those people. We stirred up all that trouble. <laughs> for nothing? No. No. Not for nothing. For living. <laughs> Now we get that boy back, and we go. 
trust me. Hey, Dutch, we got a problem. But not a problem. Not even plan Visitors, plan nice. a solution. Good day, fine people. Mr. Vanderlind, Mr. Matthews, I presume. And who are you? Rip Van Winkle. Huh. Good day, sir. Agent Milton, Pinkerton Detective Agency. Agent Ross. Ah, Mr. Morgan, nice to see you again. And to what do we owe the pleasure, Agent Moron? I don't know if you're aware, but this... Mm -hmm. This is a civilized land now. We didn't kill all them savages only to allow the likes of you to act like human dignity, and basic decency was outmoded or not yet invented. This thing, it's done. This place ain't no such thing as civilized. It's man, so in love with greed, mm -hmm. he has forgotten himself and found only appetites. And as a consequence, that lets you take what you please, kill whom you please, and hang the rest of us? Who made you the messiah to these lost souls you've led so horribly astray? I'm nothing but a seeker. Mr. Milton. You ain't much of anything more than a killer, Mr. Vanderlind. But I came to make a deal. It's time. You come with me, and I give the rest of you three days to run off, disappear, and go and live like human beings someplace else. You came for me? Risk life and limb in this den of lowlifes and murderers so that they might live and love? Ain't that fine. <laughs> I don't want to kill all these folk, Dutch. Just you. In that case, it'd be my honor to join you. Excuse me, friends. I have an appointment to keep with... I think your new friend should leave now, Dutch. You're making a big mistake. All of you. <laughs> yeah. Well, then I'm gonna, the, the, the we have got there. something. Something to live and die for. How awful for us. Mr. Milton, stop following us. We'll be gone soon. I'm afraid I can't. And when I return, I'll be with 50 men. All of you will die. Run away from this place, you fools. Run. Come on. Get your damn hands off of me. Boy. What now? We get out of here. And quick. Any ideas? Mm -hmm. I know a big old house. Hidden in the swamps outside Saint Denis. I'm sure they'll find us eventually, but it should buy us a few days. A few days is all we need. There's a spot out by Shady Bell. Lenny and I got into that dispute with the previous occupiers. The place is well hidden. You and Arthur, right out to make sure no one else has moved in. Lenny, go follow those fools out of here. Make sure that they leave. And John, we'll get Jack back. And we'll get going. Rest of you, get packing! Mm -hmm. Come on, yeah. John. It is crazy. Mind. We'll get packed up, but we need a new spot, Arthur. Boy. Follow me. I know the way. gonna be all right, John. We should be going for Jack. We will. We have to move everyone first before that bastard Milton comes back with an army. We ain't no use to Jack in jail. Or at the end of a rope. I don't even know what to think no more. Just gotta keep our cool. Be smart about this. Smart? Are you joking? We made too much noise once again. We drew him right to us. I mean... How many people we killed the past few weeks? Far too many. It's Dutch playing his games. Hosea, too. Getting involved with those two families. Master con men working their magic. They thought there was a lot of gold. Yeah, they thought there was money. Ain't there always. Look, Marston, I don't know what to tell you. Things don't always work out. That ain't nothing new. Jack's gone. We lost Sean. Mac, Davey, Jenny, and for what? We can't change what's done. We can only move on. One day, we 
need to start learning from our mistakes. Come on, it ain't all bad. We've had a rocky run. We'll be okay. We'll get through it. <laughs> Dutch will fix it. Dutch will come up with a big plan. Watch out. Right now? Hey, wait up! Hey, get out of Gets us into worse trouble. We're getting further from where we're meant to be going. That's it up ahead. Four yeah. walls and a roof. We're moving up, up in the world. Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. You sure this place is empty? I ain't sure nothing. All right. Oh, shit. The here. It's them again. Boys! Ah! Still some here. I can see that. You think there's more of them? I'll check the house. You keep watching. Out right here. I knew you'd come soon enough. You are some other coward like you. The bounty hunters, the freedmen, the carpet beggars, the army of criminals who stole our land and our government. I survived them all. Our fight will live on. Jesus. I think that's a lot. Didn't even have to shoot the last one. Good. Come help me with this, will you? What are you doing, Arthur? Oh, here we are. Here. Give me a hand moving these. What's wrong with you? Here. Give me a hand moving these bodies. Don't want the others walking into this. Okay. Follow me. All 
Right, this way. We'll dump the bodies in the swamp over there. Dump the body in there. Okay, I can deal with the rest of the bodies. You go meet up with the caravan, guide them in. All right, be soon. Oh, yeah, body is there. Ah, the We got fine living. No the corpses and the alligators. It's paradise. I love it. Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, would you two kindly work your magic? Arthur, take a ride with me. Sure. Come on. Dodge? Yes. Could I have a word with you? <clears throat> Not now. that girl all I've got going on and she wants to talk everything okay with you two I got far more important things to worry about right now than Molly O'Shea so where are we going to take a look at this eighth wonder of the civilized world San Denis I keep hearing about according to the map the road up this way should lead us right in there all right I guess this day ain't over yet not quite. Good work yeah, back the there, Arthur. Everything went okay? Mm -hmm. A few loose ends. Nothing major. And John? About what you'd expect. He's taking it hard. We're going to get that boy back. Whatever it takes. I need you to start asking around in the city for Bronte. Subtly, of course. Public places, maybe start with the saloons. Anyone who can put us in contact with him. Of course. What about the Pinkertons? I'm fairly sure nobody followed us. We moved out fast. We should be safe for a few days here. And then? I think we need to move a little further. Put some ocean between us and all of this. The mess with those two families. Losing Sean. I see things differently now. For a long time, I truly believe... Watch out! I truly believed a paradise lay somewhere in the west for us. But I just don't know anymore. So we're leaving the country now? Maybe. Okay. I'm and still thinking about out. it. Whatever okay. we do, we'll need more money. Okay, there she is. The real city. The future. Cities. They're always repellent. Exactly. I'll find you in there. Go see what you can figure out. Yes. Yes, chapter 
ஃபோர் மொத்தம் எத்தனை சாப்பிட்ரு இருக்கு பெரிய மிஷின் போல இருக்குது செஞ்ச மிஷின் ஒரு குற்றம் பண்ணதுக்கு எப்படி தோத்துருங்க ஐயோயோ போலீஸ் ஓச்சு பாத்துறான் விட மாட்டானுங்க போல இருக்க காவல்துறை நம்ம மேல இருக்கிற கேச வாபஸ் வாங்குற மாதிரி நடந்துக்கு
Hello, mister. Happy to assist Howdy. you in a moment. Costing you a pretty penny to repay your debt. Yeah, I'm not going to get a lucky set of Out of the 
damn way. Nalla gana mana kudre yamu kudu ngopa. Nalla pichigito onno. How's that horse doing? I got space for you if you need stable. Manage our nose. Upgrade up. Real fine saddles here. Absolutely. Good decision. இது நம்ம குதிரைதானா அப்புறம் பன்னெண்டு ரூபா தானா குதிரையா இருக்கும் போல இருக்கேன் அரேபியன் கப்பா ஸ்பீடு பயங்கரமா இருக்கு I've always had a way with horses, you know. Good saddle will go a real long way. Trust me. You can't have too much with you out in the wilderness. It's better to equip yourself and not need it than the other way around. Hmm. Nothing better than a well-groomed horse. Very fashionable. I really think your horse will appreciate it. Long kind of an hair long. Good day. Now, but I'm supposed to go to pitch it more. You won't regret it. Oh dear me. That's an odd name. Give me one good one. Do you know horses just love a lump of sugar? 
just my two cents. I hear the grass a few miles out is good. Horses love it. Real fine saddles here. You can't have too much with you out in the wilderness. It'll look great on your horse. Stick him up, cowboy. <laughs> yeah, real funny, Dutch. Oh, I thought so. So, here we are in a strange land of papists and rapists. America's very own Gamora. This city's all of the same to me. So, how you get on? I've been asking around about Mr. Bronte. What I've heard. This establishment is our best lead, but I haven't had any joy in there so far. So, I should just give it a shot? I think so. Just keep it cool. You know me? I'll meet you back here or not. America's dirty little French seat <laughs> over here. <laughs> That's why we love it. Born and raised. Mm. Well, I'll get you in a second. Not unless we Hey, can I get a drink away. here? No, I'm sorry. Please excuse me. I, I, I seem to have some very impatient customers. I now, how can I help? I you look like a whiskey man. Sure. Mm -hmm. Dollar, please. For a whiskey? Sure. That's the real stuff. From Scotland. Yeah. Okay. Here, have one for yourself. Well, thank you. So, mister, can I ask you a question? You ever hear of a fellow by the name of Bronte? <laughs> Who's asking? Me. I'm asking. No, leave it, Fred. What do you mean, leave it? Look, 
I don't know what business you in, but leave it, friend. You and your pal that was in here before. Mm-hmm. Bronte? Angelo Bronte? Mr. Big? Mr. Italian spaghetti eating long streak of piss big? Yeah, he makes my skin crawl. I'm so squally a cocksucker. You know what I mean, friend? Where can I find him? Oh, well, I reckon you talk to them kids in the alley, they'll know how I get. Oh, hey, friend? You will be careful now. Immigrants, they're not to be trusted. Yeah. Oh, hey, friend. जेंटलमैन मर रखा है आमा आमा। Pardon me, but have you seen any kids around this way? Yeah, I think I heard a few in the other courtyard up ahead. You can get through on the left there. Hey, you got a cigarette, mister? Maybe. Huh? I'm looking for a fellow named Angelo Bronte. Italian. I know him. Everyone knows him. Where is he? We'll take you to him. What old cost? I reckon I can pay. Five dollars. Where does he live? New York? I'm an entrepreneur. If you don't want to pay, then I don't want to walk. Oh, man. This right here. Come on. This away. Let's go, mister. You coming, Cleet? Stay close. He's to get lost around here. Going down here. Come on, then. Yeah. You new to the city, mister? Pretty much. Don't worry. No one knows it as good as me and Cleet. Is that right? Hope you won't need his services, but you got the doctor on the corner there. Nice enough, fella. That's Baron and Schreiber on the right there. Famous bookstore. Not that I'm much of a reader myself. Now over here's a real piece of art. That's the Church of the Holy Blessed Virgin, mister. Model on the famous church in Toulouse, which is in France. You been to Toulouse, mister? No. We're Catholics here, mister. Ain't Baptist or nothing. My mama said they used to burn Protestants and all, but uh... Bet they don't have nothing so fine where you come from, mister. Look at them fine steeples. Hey, hey, you little pair of shits. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Don't 
கட்டடா கைமா எனக்கு Just give it up farm boy Stop the shit Are you your You're making a fool of yourself ஓடிட்டானா ஒரு <laughs> You don't know like no one, mister. Mr. Bronte, he's got fine hair. He got a beautiful house and I am proud to work for him. He got 50 men, mister. Why he going to care a thing about you? I just want to speak with him. <laughs> I'm sure you do, mister. You and them friends of yours been asking about him all over town. He been mighty disrespected. Bunch of muddy Yankees in town asking questions. Well, you and your friend should pay him a visit, mister. He's got a big house on Flavian Street opposite the park. Hey, Yoko. Now, get out of here. Hmm, narakti ana paranga. Ulle pay or galata avanga panni utta da correct ah irukku. குதிரை வண்டி வேணும் to buy bunch of children <laughs> i won't inquire anymore but i found mr bronte seems to be some italian mr biggie town everybody knows him but nobody wants to talk about him 
apparently lives in a big house on Flavian Street, opposite the park. Huh. Good work. Good. So what now? We go pay him a visit. I'll get John, you meet us there. Whatever it takes, we need to get that boy back. I cannot decide which I like less, the swamps or the city. Both are full of parasites. That's reptiles and slime. We're a long way each to land we know, far from real open country. Hey, it's in fast. God help Look out this for? <laughs> Are you straight? Jesus. Sorry about that. Sorry about, Sorry about that. that. Who are you looking at, idiot? Come on, Hassle. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. Sorry, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. What the hell are you doing? Hardly Please touched. don't. Please, damn it. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. Excuse me. Move. No. Oh, what's going on? Hey. That's the last call. Hey, hey, what's wrong with you? Shit, what the hell? You'll be one good shot and you're dead. What the hell? Goddamn idiot. You're... Huh. Huh? 
Hey. Yeah, yeah. what up, buddy? Okay, bye. Are the parasol dinner? 